Hello guys, we are at Las Palmas for a tour of unit number 208. There's a garage right behind me. I do not have the combination of access to garage. I can find out what it is later, but for now, let's check out the unit and the amenities. So unit number 208 is an upstairs unit. You can see the balcony right from up here. Uh, it is handicap accessible per ADA laws and rules. There is an elevator shaft right here and you can access the elevator if necessary, but otherwise there's a quicker access through the staircase. There's a view of the desert straight at the end of the street, and we're just a short distance away from all the amenities, the clubhouse and a pool, which is just one row of condos over that way. But let's head up these stairs and uh, see what this unit holds on the inside. So just a one quick flight of stairs that takes us up to the exterior balcony, or if I were to turn to the left right here, uh, let me actually show you where the elevator is. So there is an elevator right here that takes you up to the top flight of stairs, but uh, I had Chick-fil-A for lunch, so I better take the stairs. There should be some pretty nice views from this unit. Even from the front balcony, you kind of see the entire development. There's some views of the desert head inside. So this unit is a two bedroom, two bath. It looks like it's mainly all original. It's got some nice leather chairs. There's a closet right off the front door. Beautiful 1980s mirrors with gold trim. Windows have some nice plantation shutters. As we go to the left, this hallway takes us down to the laundry closet. I don't know if there's a light here, probably not. Maybe one right behind us. Mm -hmm. Nope. It's kind of dim. It's a little dim. Yeah. So this takes us to the two bedrooms. There is a full bath to our left. And these panels are typically the AC unit access right up here. Also, if you haven't tried this already, this is a 360 video, so you can pan around with your device, drag around with the mouse pointer or just with your finger if you're watching this on your phone. So this bedroom just has two bunk beds and a full-size closet. Let's check out the other bedroom. This is a master bed because it has its own balcony, a larger closet, a double closet, as Michonne is demoing right now and a master bath. Master bath has a dual sink and a soaking tub. This is all original, so I would imagine, you know, it could use a bathroom and a kitchen remodel for sure. Let's check out the rest of the living room. This is a pretty good space. And let's check out the kitchen. Again, tile countertops throughout. Looks like the appliances are Whirlpool, maybe upgraded once since it was built. They don't look all original. It's just a nice white basic set. An induction oven. Classy drop-in ceilings. And this, I think, is the best part. Mm -hmm. So these views are actually out towards town. They're not out towards the desert. The desert is in this direction. But the good thing about these views is that they're not ever going to be obstructed because everything that could be built is already built. But the grade of the street is considerably below this condo, especially below the second floor. Looks like there's a little barbecue unit. Mm -hmm. And this is the balcony that takes you out here from, uh, so you get access to that balcony through that sliding door 
from the master bedroom. I think this is it. We will check out the amenities right after this. All right, guys, we're at Las Palmas, <clears throat> checking out the amenities. Let's take a look. So this is a walking distance away from unit number 208. It's literally right over there. You can kind of see it from here. This is the pathway that takes us to the clubhouse. It's a nice fountain. That looks like a splash pad, a little playground. They've been redoing all of this. Yeah, they've been remodeling this for quite some time. All the landscaping is really nice. If I remember correctly, I mean, we need to check into it, but I think the, the pool is salt water. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is a salt water pool. There is a gym. A covered pool. Let's see if we could get into the clubhouse. Yeah. Can you just go check this out? Thank you. So there's a little fitness center downstairs. And this should take us back out to the pool. Oh, it's an emergency exit only. It actually takes you back out to the lofts. Thank you very much. This is the facilities. There is the splash pad. This used to be all mini golf. Used to be mini golf. And there is the enclosed pool. little prep barbecue area. There's a big slide too. This is the kiddie pool that's currently covered. Must be a little too chilly for it. is pretty large. There's another pool. I think this one gets up to 12 feet deep on a deep end. There's a slide. Basketball court and a tennis court. walk the court. This is a full pickleball court and there's another half court for basketball. And it looks like there's some shuffle boards and a full playground as well. Let me know what you guys think. <laughs> 